What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome to my current subscribers and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas. It's just me, myself, and I here working in the spiritual realm right now on Christmas of 2021. Um, I hope everybody is doing well. Um, I do, I do, I do, who? Um, oh, I had a brain fart. Yeah. Whoops. My bad. Oh, yeah. Okay, so it's a collective reading, cast through side to everybody in between. Um, so it could resonate for all signs, possibly. You have to plug in your life, how it resonates. If it does resonate, it's a free general collective reading. So just saying. Um, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. I got a channel again, so I'm going to do this reading. Um, hopefully, this is the last one for today. Hopefully. <laughs> just saying. I've already, I worked late last night. And then up into this morning on readings, because I, I keep getting channeling after channeling after channeling after channeling in. So, I mean, I don't, it's just me. I don't mind doing it, but holy smokes, almighty, just saying. Okay, so free general reading. Um, the channeling, I was, oh, real quick, sorry. Uh, skirt. Um, if you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. Cash app only. No, I meant not cash app. No cash app. No cash app. I won't do cash app. PayPal only, no Cash App, no Venmo. Um, I do not have YouTube live on right now, so you can do it the public way through YouTube right now because I don't have it on right now. Um, but you can do it through my private PayPal account. It's very private and confidential, so if you donate um, through Hypersister 5 I do not share on here publicly your name or how much you donate. Um, I value and respect everybody's privacy. So um, anybody that's donated to me in the past, y'all know that, so just saying. Okay, so the channeling I received was a Sagittarius alcoholic is about to get into a very significant motor vehicle accident soon. Um, I heard going to uh, blow way over the breathalyzer and many negative series of chain events are about to occur for them. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Holy smokes, you guys. Holy crap. The energetic spaces on Christmas are so, wow. But, you know, the reality is and what, I know most of you guys know this. I know you know this, but 4th of July, thank, not really Thanksgiving as much, but 4th of July and Christmas, huge, huge, huge alcoholics out. Just for real, for real. Out, out, out. That's why you, you see the checkpoints out and things like that. Um, so 4th of July, Christmas, huge times. Um Huge traffic times and huge people going to bars because they're depressed and they ain't got nobody and they want to drink themselves in a bottle. So I'm not saying this is what this Sag is. I'm not saying they're going to a bar to drink themselves into the bo a bottle, but I heard they are an alcoholic. So they're not a social drinker. Um, and I feel for some of these Sages, they have, they're, I heard alcoholic. So they're either a functional alcoholic or a straight up just out like blah, 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 alcoholic. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, but an alcoholic alcoholic. So like their, um, liver, um, liver enzymes would probably be elevated. I'm, I'm sure they will be very elevated. Um, and their blood works probably off the chain. I mean, just saying, just saying, um, just saying for some, they could, they might be heading towards dialysis or on dialysis. Um, but if you're on dialysis, you can't drink and you're not supposed to drink, but I'm just saying their kidneys are all screwed up. All screwed up. Liver and kidneys. All freaking screwed up. Just saying, just saying. Or getting screwed up. How that resonates. But I heard they, uh, it's a Sag. They could have Sag in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, and hammer, Jupiter charts. Masculine or femme Sag. Um, but some kind of significant motor vehicle accident soon coming for them. But um, it sounds like when they get into this motor, motor vehicle accident, it's going to be hard significant. So I think it's going to be a lot of damage. I don't think it's going to be like a little fender bender. Or I think it's going to be like into a tree or into other vehicles or into a uh, median or in, into something that's going to cause a lot of damage is what I'm presuming. Um, because I heard once they blow on the breathalyzer, it's going to blow way over. So, I mean, it's going to be, they can't hit and run it is what I'm trying to say. It's not like no little thing off the curb and, er, okay, get back on the road. No, it's um, a significant accident to where the police have to come. They cannot get away. And they're going to blow high on the breathalyzer. I heard way over. So way over. I don't know what the the 
limit is over the breathalyzer. I don't know what it is. I used to know it when I worked at the jail, but I can't remember it now. But I heard way over it. So you plug it in, Hall, that resonates, if that resonates for you. I'm going to pull a couple cards, and then we'll see if we get anything else. I heard it's going to create several negative series of train events for the Satch. So I'm thinking it's going to create, one, it's going to create jail. It has to, DUI energy. It has to create jail. That's one. Two, it could create other charges. If they have a child in the vehicle, just saying. If they kill somebody, just saying. I mean, that that's opening a huge ass bag of worms right there. Some kind of other negative series of chain of events, and they're not going to be good. Um, and I think it's relating to this motor vehicle accident. That's exactly what I think. Um, they're about to get in serious trouble with the law, man, whoever this Sag is. If me and Mass going to have been Sag, they could have Sag in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Menhamer, Jupiter charts. We've got acceptance on the bottom of the deck, so I think they're going to accept that they are alcoholic. Maybe they were denying they were before this, or they're about to accept the fact they're about to go to jail for a DUI. Um, isn't there another one? There's like a driving under the influence, and then there's a, isn't there a more severe one? Um, than a DUI, um, like manslaughter or something like that, if you kill somebody, um, something like that. But, um, yo, hunger, hunger for alcohol. Spirit messages you have signed is that, I mean, for the collective, I'm sorry. Realization reverse, so no wake up call to the fact they are alcoholic for some. Assessing, they're not good at assessment skills, apparently. Do not assess the situation wisely or themselves wisely. Spirit messages you have signed up for the question. One of these Sagittarius's will end up losing their job. Protection. So I'm assuming in this situation, protection from um, themselves and other people. I'm thinking this is jail energy, protection from themselves, because they're out driving a freaking 10 to 20,000 pound, 30,000 pound vehicle, using it to harm person, people, place, family, or situation while under the influence. Um, and this could be protection energy as the police protecting the public, getting this alcoholic off the street. Heard one of them is going to lose their job. So I think that's the jail energy. Spirit messages you have for and I didn't hear they were going to jail, but um, that, I mean, that's logical. You know, I mean, they would have to go to jail. They would have to. I can't imagine any officer that lets them blow over and then be like, oh, yeah, see you. Have a good day. I hope not. That's a terrible officer if that's the case. Avoid upright depression. Maybe they're depressed and that's why they're, they're in the bottle. Or that maybe that's why they started drinking. Or maybe their depression is going to heighten after they get um, a DUI or the one that's more severe than a DUI. I think there's one more severe than a DUI or whatever other charges I presume on this. If they have children in the vehicle, I'm assuming it's going to be a lot worse. Uh, at least I hope it would be. Number three or one could be very significant um, numbers in one's life. I feel for some of these situations, they might end up having children in the vehicle. I do. I didn't hear that, but I kind of feel it might possibly, and I'm serious about that. Three or one could be very significant numbers in one's life. If this resonates for you or somebody you're connected to, hopefully you're not the alcoholic Sag. I feel for a lot of you guys, you were the ones, you're going to be connected to one of these people, this person. So I feel you might hear about it from a family member. You might hear about it from the Sag. You might be the one they call from jail, get out of jail, phone call, energy. Um, you might be a neighbor. You might be a coworker. You might be the employer that terminates them. However, that resonates. Um, however, that resonates. So three or one, those could be possible ages of children, possibly. Maybe they're in the vehicle, three or one, possibly. Or if it's you and you're not this alcoholic Sag, maybe you have a three or one year old, possibly. It also could be date of birth numbers, a social security number, um, numbers, um, uh, uh, green card number, um, uh, I had a brain fart. Ah. Um, or um, any other significant number, a lottery number, a jersey number, any significant number in one's life. They also could be significant reoccurrent numbers in the universe in some shape, form, or fashion. 
Also, um, I just heard 333, so let me look up angle number 333. I feel that's significant for at least one person because I heard 333. Seeing 333 repeatedly may be a sign that a looming decision needs your attention. Yeah, a looming decision to take this person to jail, looming decision to bail this person out of jail if they can be bailed out, looming decision to get them some freaking rehabilitation, looming decision to terminate them, because I heard one of them, there's two or more sides, this resonates with the universe, one's going to get terminated. Um, that's what I'm feeling the looming decision is for some of these sages. Um, it could be you making this looming decision if you're connected to this Sag or a Sag having to make a looming decision about their alcoholism, possibly, is what I'm feeling. Um, for some, if they have children in the vehicle, they might end up losing their kids. Um, I can't imagine how they wouldn't. Um, I'm serious. That That's serious. Serious. Seeing 333 three, three, three repeatedly may be a sign that a looming decision needs your attention. It's a signal that your path ahead is clear for moving forward. The 333 three, three angel number indicates that despite your fears, anxieties, misled plans, or wrong turns, you're on the right path. The universe is urging you to keep going. So looming decision and basically keep going. Keep going. Um, maybe, um, maybe they get some help after this. Maybe they get some help after this. I hope they do. I'm serious. I hope they do. So realization reversed. This Sagittarius has been living in a fantasy land, but they're about to get a huge wake up call. Huge. Some have children and some do not. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Whoa. So um, this Sag, I heard they're about to get a huge wake up call after this. Um, some of these Sages have children, some they do not. So it's two or more Sages in the universe. Some have kids, some do not. Hopefully the kids are not in the vehicle when this very serious, significant motor vehicle accident occurs. But they've been living in a fantasy land, I heard. So they have not had an awakening. They're not woke to the real world. Um, they've been living in a freaking bottle, basically. They've been living in a bottle and drowning their sorrows or reality or what have you in a bottle. The void upright. And I think some of it, some of these sages, it stems for de from depression. Because we have the void energy, which can be like depression, sadness, fear, worry, that kind of thing. Money issues are a factor here in undiagnosed major depression for some. Okay. I heard um, money factors are a key here for some of these sages and um, undiagnosed um, depression for some. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, so the void upright, depression energy, money issues, down, gloomy, gloomy, doomy energy, basically. Um, some that could, could have been what led them to start drinking. For some, it could have just um, exacerbated the drinking, however that resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. One particular person that's about to deal with this Sagittarius in the motor vehicle accident accident is about to be woke in a huge way. Huge way. They're about to see something in the vehicle and it's going to create other, other negative series of chain of events for one Sag in this situation. Oh my God. So you plug it in how it resonates. My God. So, um... Whoever this is, I heard they're going to be dealing with the Sag at the scene of the crime, basically, the motor vehicle accident. I think whoever this is, if this re particular message resonates with you, I think you're an officer. I think you're a police officer. I think I, you have to be. I think you have, you're you a police officer or you're Hensy. You're either a police officer or you're Hensy, um, however that resonates for you. Um, but you're at the scene of the crime after this motor vehicle accident occurs. But I think you're either a police officer or Hensy. You have to be. Or an investigator or something, but you plug it in how it resonates, which be police officer energy, um, I'm presuming. But 
I heard you're about to sit, you're about to get really woke when you, because this hasn't occurred yet. It's about to occur. Um, it's a Sagittarius and a motor vehicle accident regarding alcoholism, and they're about to blow way over the limit, basically. But it sounds like when you start assessing the situation, the accident, do the breathalyzer, yazzy, 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 you're about to see something in the vehicle. Um, and it's going to create other negative series of chain events for the Sag. So I don't know what you're about to see. Only you know your story, not me. And this hasn't happened yet. So whoever this is for, but you're, you have the officer energy I'm feeling or him see how that resonates. But, or you could be, um, yeah, officer or him see. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so I'm thinking it could be drugs, a weapon, like a unread, uh, unlicensed gun, a, um, drugs or, um, or maybe it's um, like paraphernalia, drug paraphernalia, or it is um, something of that nature. Um, or maybe it's some kind of something on the floor that alerts you, like some kind of something else, um, like a weird object or, or something. I didn't hear that. I'm just trying to think what else it could be, like a weird object or something written on a note or something it's something in the vehicle that's about to alert you whether it whether it's drugs or paraphernalia or um maybe it's alcohol bottles all over the place um maybe it's um you know cans empty cans empty beer cans maybe it's um you know what have you or make or something else or something else how that resonates all right we're done I love you guys so much. If you think anyone else can benefit from these messages, be sure these videos on your social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. Love you guys so much. Namaste.